Hey folks, welcome back to another Star Wars Black Series review. We're looking at Ned B, the newest of the new from Obi-Wan Kenobi. Really, really great figure. This is the first Star Wars figure that I've gotten that's come in the uh, plastic-free packaging. And, uh, you know, it's okay. I'm, I'm glad the figure inside was good. Because, um, yeah, we only have to go by the packaging. We have no idea whether there's going to be QC issues at play inside until we open it up. But um, considering what the package is, I'm I'm cool with it. You know, it's going to end up in the bin. I don't really care. But they're um, yeah, definitely letting us know that it's plastic free. And uh, yeah, it's it is what it is. What I do like is on the side of the packaging here. We do have they do give you an accurate height of the figure. So six point six inches, uh, the equivalent of sixteen point eight centimeters. They've got to put the inches in. For the Americans who have yet to change to metric, <laughs> but that's cool. No, it's it's all good. So that's that's a nifty little feature. But the accessories got the got his got his hammer and his blaster on the back. No special bio. Um, for some reason, all the Obi Wan Kenobi figures have been getting the same little write up artwork on the side, so you can still have it as part of your mural, which is cool. And that's, that's the packaging, so we're going to get straight into the figure and have a good look at him. And uh, here he stands. So we'll take a look at his accessories. He does come with his uh, Battle Droid Blaster. I'm pretty sure it's the Battle Droid one. Very similar if it's not. I'm pretty sure it is, though. So it's nicely, nicely sculpted. It's in a sort of harder plastic, it's which is something they've been doing a little bit of recently, which is nice. So that's cool. Also comes with this hammer or mallet or whatever you want to call it, which is nice. Do like the sort of sculpt on the on the hammer head there. That looks good. Looks like it's seen a little bit of work. In the handle. So onto the figure. Here we have Mr. Ned B. Really nicely detailed. This looks like a little bit like makes me think of Bumblebee. <laughs> like you feel like this guy could just sort of transform into a Volkswagen Beetle. Um, but yeah, the backpack here is removable. It actually comes separate, um, so you can put that on. I'll probably end up super gluing this on. Although I don't think it's going to go anywhere. It's a nice snug fit. Um, the little bit here is these little little cables here that sort of come out of his back and do sort of plug into the side of the backpack there. So it's a, that's a can be a little bit fiddly. Um, but once you line them up and get, get it in there, it's fine. But yeah, proving difficult on camera, but I'll get there afterwards. So it does have Ned B written there in Oribesh, which is cool. I'm pretty sure it is anyway. If we zoom up, we'll get a look at his head. So he's got some articulation there under the head and the neck. Doesn't only really offer a great amount of movement, but it works. But yeah, he does look nice. The weathering and all the detailing and stuff is really well done. Just feels like it all sort of fits in. You know, all the edges and stuff have all got sort of wear marks on it. He's definitely a definitely a worker droid. Let's see, he's got some cool, yeah, like I said, cool edging and stuff. With the detailing and the weathering. His hands. He does have some good articulation there. The joints, again, very sort of similar to the K2 units. They're using these sort of clear clear pins, which is cool. It's just the, uh, the aesthetic of the droids, which I think is cool. I like it. He 
but yeah, he's got good range of articulation. Does hold the weapons well. The blaster's a little bit tricky. Kind of just requires one finger to sort of just sit in there. But, you know, I'm just going to display him with the hammer anyway. So it's, um, you know, that's it is what it is. So that that's cool. I do like the blue on that one arm there. It just looks like he's he's had a bit of a retrofit. But yeah, very nice, impressive figure. Joints on the ankles. Yeah, he's got the hinges and the joints. Nice, nice movement. Really nice movement all throughout this figure. So he's a good addition. I uh, wasn't s expecting to see him out just yet. But uh, yeah, he popped up in Zing Pop Culture, so I, so I swooped on him. Um, and yeah, really, really nice to add this one to the collection. So I hope you've enjoyed this look at Ned B. Got a couple more reviews coming right up, so stay tuned over the next few days. Some more videos coming soon, so um, yeah, stay tuned. Thank you very much for watching, and uh, may the force be with you, always.